This is the bank's magnetic iPad stand. It's designed to hold the 12.9 inch 3rd, 4th and 5th generation iPad Pro. Let's talk about the build and quality of this iPad stand. It's made of thick aluminum, it weighs 1.8 pounds, it comes in space gray, the magnets on this stand are very strong and hang on very securely onto the iPad. Even with the weight of the 12.9 inch M1 iPad Pro, this stand hangs onto it very sturdy. Setup and operation of this iPad stand is very simple. It folds away very easily. So all you gotta do is flap this down, flap this over, and that's it. Very compact to store away. And to unfold it, it takes a little bit of effort to get this bottom piece out, but it folds out with a, just a little bit of effort there. And once you got it folded out, this iPad stand is ready to go. Mounting your iPad onto the stand is very simple. All you gotta do is start from the top, slide it down until the magnets grab onto the iPad. Once the magnets grab onto the iPad, it grabs on very securely. Operating the stand is very simple. You can have your iPad in horizontal orientation or you can rotate it to have it in portrait orientation. And in either orientation, you're gonna be able to swivel the angle of the iPad as such. And then you can also change the angle with the bottom plate here. So you can bring this down further. So if you wanna draw on your iPad, you can definitely do that with this stand here. So you can bring it to a very low angle so that you can easily draw on your iPad as you can see here. To remove the iPad, I recommend hanging onto the bottom of this stand and then grabbing your iPad from the top and then tear it away. That's the easiest way that I found to remove your iPad from this stand. Now let's talk about the pros and cons that I found with this iPad stand. For the pros, this iPad stand is built very well. It feels premium. It feels very sturdy when the iPad is mounted onto this stand. Setup is very simple and I love how it folds down and stores away very easily and takes up very little space. The magnets are very strong. Once your iPad is mounted onto this iPad stand, it's not going to let go of your iPad very easily. In order for you to uh, tear your iPad away from this stand, you really have to put some force into it, which is the reason why I recommend for you to hold to the, onto the base of the iPad stand while you tear away the iPad because it does take a little force to be able to tear your iPad away from these magnets. The only con that I found with this iPad stand is not a deal breaker by any means, but the bottom plate does have a little more tension than I would like it to have. So it does take a little effort to get the bottom plate to adjust. Now, I say it's not a deal breaker because uh, being that it's the bottom plate, I'd rather it have some tension really good tension there so that I'm not uh, going to risk my iPad coming down easily. You know, it's gonna take a little effort for you to be able to angle the bottom piece on this iPad stand. So although it might be a little bit, uh, a little bit of a drawback being that it has tension and you do have to kind of uh, put a little bit of uh, muscle into it to get it to uh, adjust, I don't uh, count that as a deal breaker by any means. This has now become one of my favorite accessories for my 12.9 inch iPad Pro. I hope you found some value in this video. If you did, hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. That way you get notified the next time we upload a new video. And on that note, I will see you on the next one.